Are you considering buying a new lawnmower? If you've been to a hardware store recently, then you've probably seen that they have two sections, gas and electric. And sure, a gas-powered mower is tempting. After all, that's what we know. But if you look on the other end of the aisle, you will find electric mowers that are just as good or better. And let me tell you why. You should consider going the electric route. First of all, you never have to fill up one of these gas cans ever again in your entire life. And you never have to deal with mixing oil into the gas, or changing the oil, or changing one of these air filters, or changing one of these spark plugs, and all of the hassle and expense that goes with that junk. Now I know what you're probably saying, okay Vlognosis, but can a lawn mower handle this disaster of a lawn? I mean, electric mowers are weak, right? Well, stay tuned. I think that you will be pleasantly surprised. So I picked up this Cobalt self-propelled rear-wheel drive electric mower from Lowe's. And let's go ahead and open it up and find out. With any new mower, you have a little bit of assembly required. Inside of the bag here, we have the battery charger and the battery. And I see here that we have a few manuals explaining all this stuff, which I will never read, so we will toss those to the side. Let's go ahead and assemble the handle which really in this case is all that needs to be done. After putting the handle on, you are almost ready to go. You just need to charge the battery and it has a convenient indicator to let you know what the level is. But you don't have to fill up any oil, you don't have to fill up any gas, none of that. I can see from the meter that we are good to go. So let's take this battery out of the charger and plug it in to our brand new electric lawnmower. That's it. That's all that's needed. You are officially ready to start cutting grass. Now let's just take a moment to appreciate how clean this mower is because it will never be this clean ever again in its lifetime. It's a thing of beauty. And as we can see from the instructions, hold A and pull B, or pull B and hold A, same thing. Basically, it looks like this. Let me tell you, your neighbors are going to love you because this thing is about half of the noise level of a traditional gas mower. Uphill, downhill, this thing tackles it all. It's doing a really good job. I have it set up in the mulching configuration. There's no side discharge vent on it right now. And you can see that it's handling this with ease. If you have a little bit of a slope in your yard, no problem. This mower handles it just as easy as anything else. All right, let's test out that side discharge. Let's go ahead and start the mower up again. Really easy. 
no pulling on any cords a few times and pulling your arm out of its socket. And as you can see, it's handling this just as easy as anything else. What do we have here? Oh, it looks like we have a guest star today. All right, back to business. Now we're getting into some really thick, wet grass right here. And as you can see, the mower is doing a good job. All you have to do to get freshly cut lawns like this is plug your battery in and charge it up for a few hours. If you're worried about getting an electric mower, it's time to stop worrying and start enjoying just how simple it is to operate this beautiful piece of machinery. Anyway, that wraps it up for today's video. I hope you enjoyed watching. Let me know your feedback. Do you have an electric mower? How do you like it? Chime in in the comments below.